Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Sly 2. In the previous episode, we shut down the last few engines, got the last few clues, got our new shadow power, which is I'm pressing the wrong buttons for, but we have it. We don't have any stamina to show it off, but we got that. And uh, now we're going to go get some beacons so Carmelita can find us. Okay, Sly, we need to send Carmelita a radio pulse so she can home in on the blip. To do that, I'll need you to get on top of four very tall towers. They are too big to climb and too tall to jump up normally. What's this all got to do with this thing you've got me wearing? It's an experimental mega jump pack. By pressing the R2 button, you'll perform a huge jump. So be careful. All right. Sounds like fun. Hmm. A big jump. Whoa! It's like we're on the moon. Whoa, that's awesome. <laughs> well, that was our shadow move, and now it's our super duper high jump move. Okay, we have to get to the tops of all of these towers. Okay. So this possibly could be the last episode, and if it's not, then the la next one will probably be the last episode, if there is another one after this. I don't know, you can probably tell by the title if this is the last episode or not. How are we going to get up there? Can I, like, jump onto this thing? No, I can't. It's rotating too much. Oh, wait. There's, uh, there's, like, sections here that we can actually stop on. So we just do this. Maybe if I go over here? How do I get up to that height? Maybe, you know what? Let's try this. Let's try going over here. Jump up. Grab onto this thing. Yeah, that's what they want you to do. And we just stop here and make our way up. Oh, this is so cool. Can I use this in like the other levels, please? Because it's a lot of fun. Whee! Uh, okay, let's go to this one up here. You know, if I didn't get the last clues over here, we would have found it with this super fancy high jump move. These ones... It took me so long, 15 minutes or 20 minutes in the last one to find. Uh, oh shoot. Well, you know what? We can easily just jump up here. Look at that. We would have been able to easily get it. <laughs> so cool. Oh my goodness. This is the best. I got really lucky with getting through that uh, one hole on this one here. The one section there. Anyway. <laughs> I didn't know where the uh, jump up part was. I was just hoping maybe that was the right way to go. Woo! Oh, missed it. We're dead. Ooh, this is a tricky way to go. Uh, right there. Okay, I saw where we have to go. Uh, nope. Nope, nope. It's okay. We can get back up there really <laughs> easily. <laughs> this is so cool. I can't get over it. Oh, man. I'm sorry I've said it so many times, but it's so true. Look at this. Whee! I love zero gravity in games. It's so much fun. I mean, it's not. this isn't really zero gravity, but it's pretty close to it. It's pretty fun. Especially for a game from, like, 2004, I would not expect this game to have this ability to do such a thing. It's like moon jumping. Oh, shoot, wait. Jump here. Up here. Yeah, like the last one, we gotta jump onto like this spinning rotator thingy do. Yeah, and then we just jump over from there. And then find where the hole is. Yep. Carmelita has picked up on our signal. She's now headed on an intercept course directly for us. Ninety-eight percent. Okay, maybe the episode. Maybe this is the last episode. <laughs> Possibly. Oh my goodness. We didn't get to see all of Bentley's moves. Uh, I realized that at the end of the other one. I, I wonder if I could... Do I still have the fancy jump pack? Can I do that some more, please? I want to play with that a bit more. 
Oh, we switch back. Okay, wait, let me just switch to Bentley real quick because we want to see what powers he has because we haven't really seen everything that he can do. So if we try R2 with that size destabilizer, we haven't tried any of this stuff. Uh, health extractors, like we haven't done anything here. Let's try a size bomb and we'll try that. Oh, actually, you know what? Let's try the cosmic. So slow down time. Wee! Oh, that's so much fun! It's a little jetpack. And then. Is that. Is this a shrink ray? Oh, we're out of. We're out of mojo juice! Got it back. We got our mojo back. So let's try this out again on this guy. Oh, it just freezes them in place! Cool! Let me try this little shrink thing, though. That's what I want to try and do. Ah, 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 look, he's little baby. Little baby birdie. Anyway, me enough uh, messing around. All right, here we go. Final boss. Look, Sly, for once, let's cut the flirty chit chat and get down to business. I need an experienced tail gunner. Jump in and grab the gun. We've got a bird to take down. That's not flirty chit chat. Get on in. We're gonna pew pew pew. Oh no, this is gonna be like the last game, isn't it? Looking good. Aw, oh, she's so nice. Wow, she's giving us compliments. Alright, let's take down Clockla. Why does the final fight have to be a first person turret thing? Uh, take that. Oh no. Luckily, these missiles are very slow, but I hate this. It's clockwork, but you call her Neela a second ago? Ma'am? Are you okay? It's clockwork. Just just say that. Just mix it up a little bit. Oh, yeah! <laughs> okay, so the red ones require two... I'm, I never said anything. Um, yeah, so... Anyway, what, what was it saying before that? I forget. I already forgot. I was so focused. It's so hard to focus on shooting. I don't like this. I do not like this these missiles. Maybe it was just the ah uh, yeah part. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I was where I was going with anything. I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Learn to aim. Learn quickly. Learn to aim. <laughs> Ma'am? I people have told me that no! Get this away from me. This is giving me like PTSD from the last fight last time. I cut all that stuff out for you guys so you guys didn't have to see it, but oh my goodness, the, the last boss fight, final boss fight, took me like an hour and a half probably to beat. I hope this is not the same case. We're not doing all, uh, too bad for um, the HP though, we're almost at like half of hertz. We're just missing all the missiles, I'm not even trying to hit the missiles actually to be honest. Probably should be. Oh, uh, we're gonna die. How am I supposed to stop those? Do I shoot the outside? I'm not really sure. Maybe. All right, we made it back. I figured out how these things work. You can only shoot them once, and it just disables it. Yeah, I was shooting them so many times. So the more you shot it, the more uh, it it just comes back to life, and then it hits you. That's not good. That's not good. Oh shoot, like that. For example, there. But now I got it. I figured it out. I know the keys to the kingdom now. Not gonna like that. This is uh, this is a tricky boss fight. Have I mentioned that yet? Keep at it. We're winning. Are we though? Like we're really low on HP. This is like the best I've done in, out of all the times that we tried to do this fight. And it's uh, it's very tricky. Oh shoot! I reactivated that one. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm bad. I'm sorry. This is, uh... Oh, we're not gonna get this one in time. Oh, wait. No, we got it. Okay. We're good. We're doing well. Come on. Uh... Nope. Crap. I 
reactivated. I, I panicked. <laughs> All right, basically back to where we were. Flawless so far, by the way. Absolutely flawless. Uh, now is probably when I'm going to start screwing up because I'm commentating. Yeah, like what the heck was that? How do you dodge that move? I don't know. Do I shoot at her when it happens? You should have been a cop. That was some terrific shooting. Fly! Fly! Oh, we've got a serious problem here. Clockola's looking mighty upset, and I think she's going to take it out on us. I'm coming, guys. Hold on. Oh, man. We have, like, an actual running section to do here. Oh, no. Help, please. Someone. This is such a cool level. I love it when they do these kinds of things, like, in movies or in uh, video games. It looks so awesome. A lot of fun to play through, too. I'm hyperventilating. I need a paper bag. I need a paper bag. <laughs> Uh, I don't even know where I'm supposed to be running. It's just really good level design that I know, like, hey, jump from here to here. Luckily, we have our glider. Hurry, Sly! We're going down really fast! Yeah, well, not that fast because I'm able to run on the, all these things, um, Marvel superhero style. Oh, come on! I missed that one! Oh! Oh, almost. Almost saved it. All right, all right. We made it. We made it. Yes, good. We're doing it this time. They say different voice lines each time, which is very nice. It doesn't get annoying, so you're not like, oh, this is stupid. Hurry up, Sly. This is getting kind of out of hand. Even Murray's saying things now. Okay, we got this. You want a piece of me? Don't worry. There's plenty to go around. You might have a new body, Neela. But you're still the low-down, backstabbing coward we've beaten time and time again. This won't be any different. Be brave while you can, Cooper. I might not have been with Hazard of one of your hate, but I feel some... some power growing within me. Oh, now it's at the same health point. Now we gotta take her down from here? Okay, so how do we... how do we attack her? Nope, don't do that. <laughs> uh, what do you want me to do, game? This this is uh, a little confusing. You want me to go over here? Where's Bentley to say, oh, I think you should try doing this. Okay. Oh, we smacked the head like in the last game. Kind of works. Hit, and then we land after we hit. <laughs> yeah, it's exactly the same as the last game kind of thing. Just smack him in the head a little bit. Okay. It's a weird, but... Oh, jeez. She threw me off. Very strange. This is a very weird ending. Gotta time it. We. we did it! Right on! It's an emotional moment. Die, Zek! Die! I hate you! Watch out, that thing's still kicking. Lakla mentioned something about a hate chip. It sounded like the source of her power. If we remove it, she might stop attacking. Then let's do a little open head surgery. I'll pry open that beak so that family can go to town with this bomb. Yeah, we get to use them all in the final fight in some way. That's so nice. Come on, let's go. Open it up. 
Opening. Opening. I hate you, Koopa Gang. I will find you in your sleep and I will destroy you. You will never know a moment of peace for the rest of your short, miserable lives. The clock love will know revenge. I am revenge. I am the Alpha and the Omega. Clock love. And now we bring in Bentley in there to do some little bomb work. Okay, not that that close. Bird dentist achievement. I still have my hate shit. You will not defeat me ever. Let's get out of here. She's about to explode. Glasses. Huh? Bentley, I'll save you. Pick me up. I can't walk. Come on, Sly. Let's get out of here. And there we were, at the end of the road. The claw gang had been defeated, and the clockwork parts lay scattered around in heaps. Yet, despite the explosion, they remained pristine. It was as if nothing could ever hurt them. Carmelita cursed herself for showing up too late to get a few shots in on Clockla. So she took it out on what was close at hand, the hate chip. And just like that, it was over. Without that core piece, that essential center of clockwork, there was nothing left. The parts aged before our eyes as if time had finally caught up with the ancient bird. How ironic that Carmelita, a police officer, would be the one to lift the curse from the Cooper family. The menace of clockwork would never again rise to threaten me or my children. True to her nature, she informed us that we were all under arrest. But one look at my gang told me that we were in no shape for a fast getaway. So I offered to go peacefully in exchange for letting my friends walk. They'd taken some bruises through all of this, but I was surprised, shocked really, to see them leave their gear behind as they walked away. Their wounds were deeper than I'd imagined. Those guys were hurting. Carmelita's old police unit soon arrived with me in custody, her name was cleared, and she even got a well-deserved promotion. It was the least I could do. The ride to HQ started with us sitting in silence, trying to read each other's thoughts. As the reality of my capture started to sink in, she began to relax, and we got to talking. We spoke freely about our previous adventures, comparing notes and even getting in a few laughs. Then we started talking about, well, everything, books, music, art. It was like we were on a first date. She even showed me the bottle she'd been saving for the special occasion of my arrest. My heart sank when she realized that our short flight across town had already taken two hours, a fact I kind of clued into after seeing the Eiffel Tower float by 17 times. She went forward to ask the pilot what was up, and it looked like my pals had left me a little going away present before taking off. Floating away on the night breeze, I could faintly make out Carmelita's voice. I'll find you, Cooper! I'll be seeing you soon, Green Tail. I, I did know that Bentley, uh, he, he ends up being like a wheelchair. I knew that that happened. I thought that it would have happened in the third game. I didn't know it happened at the end of this one, though, and I didn't know how it happened. So that's, uh, that's a pretty interesting thing. Anyway, we finished the game. I wasn't, uh, expecting this so soon. Uh, anyway, I guess I'm a day short, but I guess I'll take my break now. 
uh, for the next little bit, and we'll come back with a new game. For you guys, it's actually going to be just tomorrow, but uh, yeah. Oh, they show all the voice actors and stuff, too, as a fancy little part. Oh, that's so good. Anyway, we're going to see if there's anything after the credits again, because there was last time. And, uh, yeah. <gasps> she was Carmelita and Neela? Wait, what? That's pretty cool. You've won. You've seen everything. Go outside. What an ending. Oh my goodness. Well, we got them all 100% too. We got every single clue. We got all the stuff and uh, we bought everything. So we did it. We completed the game. Not bad. Uh, so anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. So I want to thank everyone for watching this episode of Sly 2. And uh, yeah, have a great rest of your day. Goodbye for... Wait. Wait a minute. What's that? What was that? Oh, it's just the credits again. Okay. Well, anyway, I thought that was something cool. Uh, that's gonna do it though. Thank you guys so much for watching. Goodbye for now, my friends. Uh, Carmelita?